Football analyst Colin Murray believes whoever replaces Dennis Lawrence as head coach of the senior men's national football team must not be a stopgap coach, but one who can lead the team long term with a sustainable plan. Murray spoke to Kent Fuentes today. Lawrence was relieved of his duties as head coach of the senior men's football team this past weekend after almost three less than successful years at the helm. Murray believes, based on his record, the decision to move on from Lawrence was expected. There, there reaches a stage where you lose the dressing room. You know, you're just not able to motivate your players. They don't seem to be able to play how you want them to play. And unfortunately, Lawrence had totally lost the, the Trinidad Tobago dressing room. Um, you know, anywhere else in the world, then this would have been fired long, long ago. Um, so it's not an unexpected move. According to Murray, the person that replaces the man that scored the goal to book a first ever appearance at the World Cup in 2006 must be one chosen with the future in mind. I would hate to see them just rush this thing and say, oh, we don't have no time, because that's the excuse, eh? we don't have no time. And they appoint somebody and they get it wrong. This is something we've got to get right. So don't tell me now about you bringing in somebody interim for just to get us into the Gold Cup qualification for the Gold Cup. We have a game thing against Barbados or Ghana, whoever wins that one for qualification for the Gold Cup, that's fine. Um, but you want beyond that. You want somebody now that you've, you've got a four-year plan, um, that four or five-year plan down the road. With the termination of Lawrence's contract, the already financially strapped Football Association would have to find the means to hire a new coach. And Murray offered a solution he believes can work. This United TTFA came in on the, the premise that they would be seeking sponsorships, etc. We could probably get a sponsor for the coach. Mm -hmm. If we get a coach, say, I, and I, I, you know, I'm looking at, say, uh, maybe 12,000 US a month, because you ain't gonna get somebody for less than that, um, 15,000 US a month. Why we can't get that sponsored? Look at it over a five year period and say, okay, over the five years, we will have to pay a coach. Um, Two and a half million dollars, four million dollars, whatever the amount comes up to, and get that sponsored. Kent Fuentes, TTT Sports.